any article, any video, or a mention of a 5-cylinder brings my attention, and I believe I'm not the only one. There is something special about a 5-cylinder engine, and perhaps it is the number of the cylinders, the oddness, or the ability to create a unique and one of the best sounds in the automotive world. I'm with the Eraser, and today I want to show you some of the strangest 5-cylinder engines in the world. If you like this type of content, a subscription would be massively appreciated. Thank you. Starting this list with a Volvo 850 BTCC, possibly the highest revving car 5 cylinder engine. This race car was developed for British Touring Championships, and Volvo decided to put a station wagon on the grid and handed it over to Tom Wilkinson Racing for a racing treatment. They stripped the 850 to bare chassis weighing 950 kilograms on scales. The engine was a 2.3 liter turbo with a lowered displacement to 2 liters and a removed turbo. It featured individual throttle bodies, a large carbon air intake funnel in the front, and 290 horsepower at 8,500 rpm. Isn't a more Honda engine layout than an inline 4, especially paired to a VTEC system. However, it is really weird to hear a 5 cylinder Honda even though it sounds amazing. This Honda G series was the only car 5 cylinder engine with the G20 and G25, ranging from 155 to 190 horsepower. There is nothing in common with the B, H, or F series. It only resembles a single cam F series engine block with an extra cylinder. <laughs> this Deutz F5L912 is a famous air-cooled tractor engine, and possibly one of the few 5-cylinder air-cooled engines. It was also used in various other agricultural equipment, and it is not recommended to run it in a stationary use compared to other engine brothers in the series, supposedly for having an advanced injection and combustion system making enormous pulling power. Finally, there is no turbo or a supercharger, but it can overheat. The engine is as old as we from Generation Z and is currently still produced. Can you mention a two-stroke five-cylinder engine? Well, this is Mercury Force 150, a short-living engine from 1989 to 1994, and it received a wide bore in 1991, from 84.14 mm to 85.6 mm. I could not find the stroke or the overall engine displacement. I can only say that it produces about 150 horsepower, about the same as a successor, a 3 liter inline 4 engine. Allegedly, it uses 3 carburetors, one for the middle cylinder. many diesel 5-cylinder engines, but some which stand out a bit more are by Mercedes, like OM602, 605, 612, 
617 or 647. History knows a lot of Mercedes diesel 5 bangers and some stand out a bit more than others. Especially the 602 besides the 617 are considered the most reliable engines in the world able to run over 1 million kilometers without an overhaul. The 602 was only a single overhead cam engine using natural or force aspiration, an indirect or direct mechanical injection. No, there is not a ton of power, but most certainly a ton of German engineering. There is one 5 cylinder engine which is a bit more unique than the others and it is the VR5. It was created from a 2.8 liter 6 cylinder. The VR5 is the first of its kind as a 5 cylinder and remains a rare layout in the automotive world. There are two versions, a 10 valve lower compression ratio variant and a 20 valve high compression ratio 170 horsepower unit. It has a cable operated throttle body, a variable intake manifold and port injection by Bosch. Also, some of the tiniest 5 cylinder engines, and besides the Honda RC149, a 125cc 5 cylinder engine revving over 20,000 rpm, there are also Mocky Radial 5 engines. If you are an RC aircraft lover, Mocky got you covered with a large variety of engines, not only with 5 cylinders offered, with 180 to 400 cc of engine displacement. These are from 9.5 to 23 horsepower engines weighing from 4.6 to 9 kilograms easily. They are fed by a carburetor and burn a 50 to 1 two-stroke fuel oil mix. If you want one, 4,000 euros. The V5 is nothing new and was spoken about many times. The Honda RC211V was the most famous and successful Big Bang V5 engine with a 75.5 degree engine alongside Mondial V5 using the same basic layout and was supposed to launch in 2019 for streets using a production V5 engine. Proton also claimed to race with a V5 14,000 rpm revving engine, but obviously that did not happen. The same sad story goes for the GM V5, which was based on an Oldsmobile V6 diesel engine, being a 60 degree engine meant to have 70 horsepower. It is exhibited at Ari Olds Museum in Michigan. Thank you very much for watching, comment down below which one you like the most and see you in the next video. Cheers!